This is Dawson Meadows with the Video Wire, the most trusted name in local news and things to do. And, and nope. <clears throat> and here's what's out there. Gateway Planning uh, revealed a detailed draft for downtown Fort Smith strategic redevelopment at a special study session with the Fort Smith city officials on Tuesday night. Scott Polikoff of the Dallas-based firm uh, behind Rogers, Arkansas's downtown redevelopment, said the initiative would accelerate momentum on private investment. More on the plan at talkbusiness.net. Fire and emergency services will return to the 188th based at the Fort Smith Regional Airport. Uh, thanks to a decision by Lieutenant General Leon Scott Catfish Rice, the move could also help uh, the city-owned airport reduce its cost for fire and rescue support. And finally, in local news, officials with the Fort Smith School District are watching the 2017 legislative sessions with uncertainty as rumblings from Little Rock uh, have left some in fear of a minimum fund balance requirement for school districts. More on this and more local, regional, and statewide news at talkbusiness.net. Things to do coming up include a big party Saturday night at the old Shipley Baking Company in downtown Fort Smith as the Fort Smith Museum of History presents Party Gras, their annual fundraising event, music by Full House, and some fine Cajun cuisine on the menu. The Polar Plunge takes place at World Class Fitness this Saturday to benefit the Special Olympics of Arkansas. Then next week, the Fort Smith Little Theater opens with its first show of the 2017 season. Check out Sense and Sensibility, directly by Mickey Vocal. Show runs February 9th through the 18th. The Fort Smith Marathon is coming up Sunday the 12th. So far, the extended forecast is looking good, but we all know that that can change. Uh, if you've not yet signed up or just one of those who wait until the last minute, you can go to fortsmithmarathon.com to get registered. The UAFS alumni Lethargic Lions are ready to tackle the relay and are excited to see everyone out. Fort Smith celebrates Mardi Gras February 15th through the 28th with a ton of things to do uh, lined up during that time. BorderTownEvents.com for a complete lineup. That's it for this week, folks. I'm busy. I got things to do. I'm Dawson Meadows for the Video Wire. Keep it positive out there. If you love Fort Smith, love it out loud. And remember, this stash is for you.